Well, here we are on what they call Independence Day. Independence Day. What does that mean? Independence Day. What does it mean to me to be independent? It means that you rely only on the self. You do not focus on anything else but the self. But in certain times, in this reality, we focus so hard on the outside world and making sure the outside world, darling, is taken care of with these nine to fives and these bills. I bet you some of y'all are at work on Independence Day or you were at work on Independence Day relating to when you listen to this. And I just feel like There is more of a purpose or there's more of a relaxation that we can rely in than going to a nine to five and feeling like we have to pay bills or do certain things in this in whatever this is. (laughs) Um, How am I feeling today? I woke up with a little bit of a cold, but I still feel very grateful to be alive and the fact that I'm here to be able to do what I do and live how I want to live and just cultivate and accumulate the energy that I want to do in this life. What I will say is there's a lot of old ways of myself that are independently going away. There's a lot of self-realization that I see in myself that is happening. You come into this world alone, you die alone, and the rest is just shit. You poop in the toilet, you flush it down. The poop goes, I'm making a weird analogy. What I say this to say is, we never really know where things are gonna go. Everything is temporary. Life is a big bag of tricks and pogo sticks with splits and... (laughs) But we got to do what we got to do. We have to move forward and we have to keep progressing our way into this world. I don't know. I don't know. I do feel like I have a headache today, but I do, you know, I really wanted to get on and try to get on and just talk. And I think maybe it's just me talking to myself on where I am and knowing that things are going to be what they're going to be and things are going to be okay. And that is okay to say is things are going to be okay. Things always have a way of working themselves out, darling. They do. Even if we don't see what they are doing, they do. You just have to say yes. You have to be able to say yes. I've been thinking lately that the only person that really exists is me. But then I'm like, that dehumanizes, my friend says it dehumanizes him if I only think the only person that exists is me. But in my mind, the only person that's talking to me is me. Nobody else is talking to me but me. I'm the only one that is in my mind talking to me because it's only me. That's it. It's powerful. That means that whatever direction I choose to go, it's only me talking to me and referring to me and going with me and doing what me has to do for me. Because it's just me. (laughs) Anyway, documentation. I love you all. Oh, shanana boo. Bye.